So how was that victory? How was that for a feeling? Yeah, it was good. Uh, particularly our first half. I think it's probably one of the best half we've played, but I mean, we all know rab uh, rugby game is 80, so we got to play a full game. I think the second half has slacked off a little bit. That's something we're going to look on going on tour, but uh, very proud of the boys in the first, uh, first half. Yeah, look, it's something we, we looked at last week. I think our defence wasn't very good against um, uh, Ulster. It's something we needed to improve on. I think um, we saw how easy it is to, to get turnovers when we, we stay in system and when we discipline. And if you look at our discipline first half and uh, compare it to the second half, it's two different things. So something we have to work on, but uh, I'm immensely proud of the boys on defence today. Guys, is, is there such a thing in a, in a rugby match where you've had such a good first half, 48 mil, that you're a little bit surprised yourself, especially against a team that, you know, was in the fight, fighting for the number of stages last year? Uh, look, I think we we always won the fast start. Um, that was actually one of our fastest starts we've had in a while. Uh, so we're really grateful for that. But yeah, look, rugby is 80 minutes. And, and we know when we get to to other opposition, we have to play for 80 minutes. And this competition is a very competitive competition. And yeah, we just we, we need to play rugby for 80 minutes. And uh, yeah, grateful for the for the first 40. But um, we need to need to step up, have a good review um, next week before we face uh, Zebra. So yeah, looking forward to that, and uh, just need to need to up it from there. Raymond, you had a really good performance yourself today. You've had a good run, uh, Curry Cup wise, uh, with help from Warrior as well, getting a nice run in the 12 jumper. Um, how do you enjoy sort of a, you know having a sustained run in the team, and uh, do you did you think your performance was uh, pretty good today? Yeah, look, I've, I've worked hard um, before before the Curry Cup. Uh, I think it was a massive opportunity. I knew I was going to be in a position to play either off the bench or to start. Um, for me, I think every every rugby player wants to be on the field and just wants to wants to be out there and play. And just having good performances um, and stuff like that is is really important. And it's our job at the end of the day. And that's that's what we what we need to do. And I think um, there's some healthy competition in the group um, that pushes us to to our ultimate performance. Um, so yeah, I'm, I'm really grateful for the opportunity, um, and I'm just doing my job. So, okay, how did it feel to scrum against Kumar? Yeah, it, it wasn't my first time scrum against him. So, luckily enough, I've gained a little bit of experience over the years. But it's it's good guy, man. Uh, world class, lucid. You know, uh, you, as as a prop, uh, there's a saying: you never stop learning. Uh, there's a few things, there's a few things that I've learned from him, uh, and how to attack a lucid, and how he attacks me as well. So grateful to play against uh, world-class lucids like that. There's a great guy as well off the field as well. So it was proper. Uh, I said probably the only place that there was a bit of an arm wrestle was in the scrum. So just take us through what that battle was like and what you have now, in hindsight, taken out of it. Yeah, look, they, they have got a, a pretty good scrum. I mean, we saw last week against the Bulls. The Bulls are no. There's no slush as well, so that's something to test himself in. Is I mean, if you look at the front row, it's pretty much a Scottish uh, front row, it's full of international players. So for us, it's, it's a learning curve. Uh, we also pride ourselves in our set piece. Uh, the thing, like you said, it was a arm wrestle today, but it, it's something we also pride ourselves in, especially here at Ellis Park. So, and then one more to some business. Uh, Yeah, obviously having having a utility, um, a, being being able to be a utility as a back is a is a good thing. But at the end of the day, yes, twelve is is my main position that I prefer to play. But if if it comes to thirteen, fifteen, wherever, I just want to play. At the end of the day, uh, serve serve the team and serve serve the jersey. So yes, twelve is is my main preferred position. But uh, I can play anywhere, and I'm happy to play anyway. One more guys, please, Ross. And uh, Raymond, the Lions attack, particularly in the first half, was fantastic. Um, great interplay between the forwards and backs. I mean, uh, your trial was made from some really nice soft hands from Asi himself, and then uh, one to you, um, JC and Frankie, some good touches there as well. Um, you know, what has sort of been the, 
core behind that to impress on attacking performance from the guys? Yeah, look, we, we work really hard um, when it comes to it comes to training, off the ball stuff and, and working through contact, playing off each other. Um, and I also just think that we, we have a really good group where, where we know each other on and off the field. Um, and yeah, those, those type of things, that, that character in the group, that uh, off-field stuff where you, you sit with your mates and you chat, that, that's where it gets built at the end of the day, uh, playing rugby like that. So yeah, grateful the coaches have, have really put big emphasis on, on that type of um, training when it comes to the training pitch. And yeah, it's just coming out on the on the game. So happy for that. Folks, thanks very much. Appreciate it. Good luck. Thank you. Thank you.